Welcome back to the channel, if you're new to the channel. My name is Kelly Jean, OMG. Before we get the video going, make sure you stay true, hit the like button, and don't be a hater of your life. Subscribe right now, go hit the sub button right now. Don't even wait. And then click the little bell, that way you can get notified every time we upload a new video. Guys, it is Monday, August 12th. It's back to school season, and our life has just been so, so, so hectic and busy. But busy is good. I am excited that the kids are going back to school because they know that they're ready to go back to school. They want to go see their friends and, you know, just go be social. And that's what our life has been these past couple of weeks, just trying to make sure we get everything situated, but we're still needing some things. So tomorrow I'm actually going to be taking CC, Leah, and Kingston to do some last minute stuff. I might bring out with me. Yeah, we need just some last minute shopping, last minute everything, because y'all know we got six kids. So this right here is like a whole task for us. But I'm gonna make sure that we vlog today and then I'll be vlogging tomorrow. Also, I'm gonna be keeping y'all updated. Can you guys believe we are just like so in shock about how fast time is flying. The reason why I'm saying that is because, let me sit y'all up right here. Lighting is good. Can you guys believe Houston is going to first grade? Um, Leah is going to sixth grade. Leah has a birthday in September, so she's really supposed to be going to seventh grade, but because her birthday is late, she's one of those late babies. She's gonna be going to sixth grade. Cece's going to the seventh grade, and Gigi's going in ninth grade she started high school and Kingston is going to be a junior this year what they are growing up so quick on us it's just crazy to think about it because when we first started this journey <laughs> Houston was a baby Kingston was still in elementary he's now in high school guys he also and I'm just like I can't believe this they're like basically halfway grown but wanted to come do this intro real quick i am doing some work it's monday we have to get on top of our job first i already cooked i cleaned did all the breakfast morning stuff it's 11 11 11 12 now but we're gonna get our day going i'm gonna go show y'all what the kids are doing lucky is currently at the office he just left about an hour ago i just got back from the dentist also they took x-rays and i'm explaining the whole procedure for me i'm gonna be getting my wisdom teeth pulled out pretty soon here i'm low-key kind of freaking out and nervous and scared at the same time but it's got to be done because this whole side is in pain and it's just discomfort and yeah it's wisdom teeth are unnecessary but whatever you gotta do what you gotta do so let's go see what the kids are doing and ask them if they're ready to go back to school uh -huh, look who we have here and Aaliyah, are you ready to go back to school yeah. We start, what's going on with your hair? Did you just wake up? No, I woke up like an hour ago. And you just been sitting here? Have you ate breakfast? No. Oh my God, you look still half asleep, ma'am. You have one more day. And then Wednesday, you have to wake up early because you have school. She's like, get out of my face, mom. <laughs> O-M-G. Okay, let's run upstairs. What are you doing? Playing on your Nintendo? Battle Royale. Battle Royale? Oh, shoot! What are you doing over here? Playing You're playing? Yeah, we're playing together. You're playing what? Battle Royale. Royale. Which is Fortnite? Houston, are you ready to go back to school? <laughs> no? no. <laughs> He's in his zone right now, guys. I'm tired of him, Houston. Yeah. Anyways, um. Oh! Oh! I disconnected you. Ooh, my bad. Hello. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> what grade are you going to? Can you tell First us that? First grade. You're going where? First grade. Are you ready? No. Today's meet the teacher. You ready to meet your teacher? Right now? Right now, right now? No, not right now, right now, boy. <laughs> I was gonna leave my teammates. You're not gonna be going to school, are you? Nope. You're gonna spend the last year you have before going to school with mom I and dad. I have supply drop is Houston. You're giving me the supply drop. What? What were you saying? You're giving I, me the I'm supply drop. I'm not going to school because I have my own working tablet for my 
for, sir, for my own self. Oh, okay, I see what you're saying. Anyways, guys, last year, Roro went to a preschool that we paid for, and that, although it was an amazing school, I'm thinking that this year we're going to be spending the last year that we have for him to not be in school, because next year he starts school, he'll be of age to go to uh, kindergarten, and I'm low-key like wanting to, you know, just spend this last year with him. I asked him, does he want to go to school? He says no. I think school is great for them as preschoolers, just so that they can get used to it, get comfortable, and just kind of be kind of advanced, if that makes any sense, um, in the learning experience and all that. Yeah. But yeah, I'm Good thinking that we're gonna keep them, keep him out of school this year. What? That might change, so you never know. But let's go see what's up with the with the girls. Bye, boys. Gigi's going to a ninth grade campus because they don't put all of the high school kids together. It's a ninth grade campus. Kingston's going to the high school high school. Cece's going to the intermediate, or no, she's going to the junior high. Leah's going to the intermediate, and then Houston's going to the elementary. So yeah, that's five different schools. And today is pick up schedule day and meet the teacher. Thankfully, they already did that for Cece, so I'm not having to do Cece's, but I have Kingston, Gigi, Leah, and Houston that I have to take to do what they have to do meet their teacher pick up their schedule and just for them to be situated for Wednesday because they start school on Wednesday so uh, this mama I'm gonna give myself a pat in the back and if you're a parent and you've been running around trying to get everything situated for back to school kudos to you kids make sure you appreciate your parents because you don't know all that it takes to make sure that you're good that way when you go to school you know you're situated clothes shoes supplies all that good stuff driving you to and from school doing the registration all that extra stuff there's little things that y'all just don't know that we have to go through as parents but I'm just so excited for them and yeah so today I have my hands full I have a busy schedule wanted to update y'all but I'll keep the vlog going here in a little bit so see you here shortly oh wait, oh wait, oh wait. Oh boy let's go see what the cards are doing Not you on the kitty iPad. All right, all right. Now we need some shorts because it's too hot for the sweatpants. <laughs> That's okay. Videos. Oh, your videos. Do you know how to tie your shoelace? No. Oh, here, hold it. Can I? So you cross it. Can I come? And you go under. You make one bunny ear, and then you. And you make the other bunny ear by going under. Look who's back. Yeah, man. Parenting one on one. Parenting one on one. What What's going on over here? You're giving them a lecture. Yeah, I'm telling them they're about to go back to school, and I don't want to hear about no boy business, cause they're not allowed to have no boyfriends. I don't want to meet no boyfriend until you're ready to get married, and you're not allowed to get married until you're 30. So you got a long time to go, don't you? Ahorita mismo, Analia. How was your day at work? Well, it was eventful, might I add. Might I add, was that necessary? <laughs> Might I say? <laughs> Anyways, what happened? You know, we've been helping people with their life insurance for about four years now, right? Today, look out chat, was the first time somebody called with yeah, a okay. death claim yeah, okay. from me. It's happened before from like people I've, I've, I've recruited and got licensed. They have sold a policy and the person passed away and they, you know, paid out the death claim. But it was the first time today Somebody called the guy's girlfriend, he, well, common law wife, they had been together for like six years. She called, said that the guy passed away last month and they're barely hitting us up. I guess they had been going through it, I don't know, but you know, they barely hit us up. We had to start that insurance claim process for the death of a loved one. So, you know. Make sure y'all get covered. Make sure y'all get covered, man. I had to send my condolences and say, hey, I'm sorry to hear that. My condolences out to you and the family. And we're gonna do whatever it takes to get this going for you. But yeah, that was the first time it happened. It got real. Other than that. I gotta go. Should I take y'all with me? Yeah, take them with you, because I don't want to hold this camera. Uh, all right, guys. Uh, We're taking them to their school to meet their teacher. Oh, damn, it's hot. Come on, Houston, hurry up. Four. We have officially made it back home from meeting all the teachers. 
My Houston, you're going to first grade. I remember last year, like he was cracking up, dying, laughing at me. Leah, how was it? Good. They're over it. I was, he was laughing so hard at me because both Houston and me we were both crying when I dropped him off. I was like so emotional. But we're back. It's so hot out here. <sighs> and I'm just glad to be back home. We got home, had to massage the feet one time. One time for the one time. How does it feel? I'm good. So good. I'm gonna take a moment and give a huge shout out to Mount Rex foot massager with a remote control. It is 10 out of 10, I'm telling you. So not only does this foot massager have two different time settings, a 15 minute or a 30 minute setting, it also has a temperature which you can put heat and apply heat to your massage. It does the kneading, so it has a low, medium, and high. It also has a compression, which tightens your feet and it feels delicious. <laughs> Okay chat, so I already got back from orientation like a little bit ago. Basically, my schedule is so bad and like the classes I have are really bad guys and I'm gonna change them but still like why would they put me in those bad classes? I'm not excited to go back to school guys. I was walking around the school and I was like, first of all, the classrooms are like so confusing. They're all mixed up, like come on now. This is black bubbles. And on top of that, like they don't even have stairs in that school, they have like ramps. Like I was walking down, it felt like I was walking down a freaking hill. I was trying to trip over everyone. It was so bad, it was so bad. And then on top of that, the cafeteria is like the size of our living room. I know I'm gonna get lost and I'm probably not gonna have fun the first couple days, but I think I'll be okay. I have not done my hair today. Don't mind my hair. I had my orientation like a few days ago and I'm happy with it. I like my school. The one thing is I don't have athletics. I don't know what it is. Like I signed up for athletics. I got for physical and everything. I don't know, it's not my schedule. I don't think I made the cut. Or I don't know. It was kind of embarrassing, not gonna lie. I don't think the coaches liked me because, <laughs> I don't think the coaches liked me because it was not on my schedule. <sighs> or it's probably cause. You're not athletic. <laughs> my bubble ran out. It's my first day of school. Didi, are you ready? Yeah. Okay, you're all done up. Girl. <laughs> and she's just like, forget this, I'm just trying to eat. <laughs> Uh, so okay. you're tell the Luchi gang that you got your new whip. I got my new whip. Have you seen it? Oh. <laughs> what are you eating for breakfast? Peanut butter sandwich. Peanut butter sandwich. Peanut butter sandwich. How to break your seeds? Okay. Hopefully the camera doesn't die. Oh my gosh! So confusing outside. Ta-da! Hey, Kisa got a new vehicle. The first day, got the car backed up. Hit the damn car. I was nervous. Kingston Loki can't drive. I feel my driver's so I to do it twice. She low-key gave him some grace and passed him just because, you know, he's got some charm in him. All right, well, I love y'all. Have a good day at school. My key's a makeshift key. <laughs> okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, bye. Love you. Be good. Bye, y'all. Ah! First day of school. And this girl, she ain't got but two hours, three hours till she go to school. She already up and ready. Why didn't you leave your hair straight? I like your hair straight. Yeah, it's up also. These girls, let me see the fit. Okay, you got the horses, you got the baggy pants. Leah's like, mom. <laughs> TC, what? let me see your outfit. And just the Ed Hardy shirts, some new jeans, some Air Posse jeans, and then the chucks. Yes. Oh, I see you. She's eating an egg sandwich. You eating? Just a banana? A banana. Yes. Cece decided to change her shoes. We bought her some new Jordans and she wasn't wearing them. So I was like, why are you not wearing your new shoes? Make it make sense, but her Houston's request, he wants a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I'm gonna be putting a high C in his lunch, and I still have to go into the pantry and see what kind of snacks, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna put some grapes into his box. I don't know how I feel about his lunch box. I ended up buying this one at Target, and it has all these little components or whatever, but I don't know how I feel about it. Last year, he had a bento box. I'll show y'all his lunch once I'm done with it. So his lunch is ready. We went with some goldfish, the little dino peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, and some grapes, and some fruit gummies. And then he's also gonna either take a high C or a Capri Sun. I think I'm gonna just do the high C. So 
to wake Houston up. It's already about to be seven. We're just gonna get him dressed and go. Cause them kids, parents at the elementary, they be in that line waiting for like two hours. They don't play no games. Hey, hey, good morning. <laughs> it's first day of school. Come on, wakey wakey. Houston, I let you sleep in, bud. Wake up, the tickle monster's here. Come on, we're gonna be late. Do you wanna be late the first day? Stretch it out, buddy. Stretch it out. Come on. Come on, wake up. Houston and Leah have always been the ones that give me a hard time. They don't like waking up early in the morning. Like slipping in. Wakey, wakey. Come on, it's already seven. Everybody else is already there. Okay, up, up, up. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Touch the sky. About to get them ready. BRB. But we live. You're ready for first grade? No. <laughs> Still asleep. Basically. Put your sleep on. Oh my God, it's happening. You are going to school. Okay, show the drip, show the drip. Oh, 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 ooh. ooh. Okay, Houston, you got this? Take a deep breath in. These elementary parents, they don't play. Doors don't open till like 10 minutes. And there's a line of people like overflowing at this front door. So we're about to go in there and drop off Houston, make sure that he's situated, take some pictures. They have some like, you know, front yard props or whatever. But here we go. Inside. It's show time, buddy, it's show time. <laughs> First grade. And then we'll just. Have a good day, okay? I love you. Just dropped Houston off, give me five. We made it before the rush. He was the first one in his class, but now we gotta take Cece. I actually have to take her because I have to talk to the nurse. She needed to get some shots. So we're gonna handle that business and then I'll be home. Breathe in and then <laughs> breathe out. Okay. You're gonna be all right, Cece. Yeah. Are you freaking out? I'm good now, I was a few seconds ago. Uh, from a scale to from one to 10, how bad is it? Kind of like a two. A two? You're yeah. okay? You're fine? Yeah, I'm okay. Yeah, right. I'm fine. Two. My shot hurts. My arm feels tingly. Oh, dang, girl. You have to get it done, though. Yeah. I have my paperwork right here. All right. So you're going to have a great day at school? Yes. All right. I love you. I love you, too. Hi! Ah, you're going to middle school? <laughs> and she went inside. Okay, now we're on our way to go home. Check on Roro, check on Lux, see what they've been up to. But this mama is done for first day of school. All of the kids are in school already. <laughs> Just dropped off Cece, she was nervous, but she'll be all right. Now let's go home. How come you're not in school? Because I'm home, homeschooled. Oh, you're homeschooled. Yeah, next time I'm gonna be in school. Next year? Mm-hmm. Yay, are you excited? Yeah, but I only just like the park and like the cafeteria. <laughs> Lunch and recess, huh? Mm -hmm. Well, I made it home and these two are sitting here bonding. <laughs> this boy, we need to put him in school now. I tell him, boy, you going to daycare next month. No, I'm not. Yes, you is. He ain't been sitting here and playing his iPad every day. I'm four years old. <laughs> Camera, are you okay? Yes. Are you okay? Yes. Are you okay? Yes. Are you okay? Yes. Do you need to take it? Are gonna do today? Yes. We're about to go to the park. I told Ro Ro we're gonna walk to the park. Alrighty, let's go. All right, guys. Well, we're gonna go ahead and get our day going. I'll update y'all once the kids get back to uh, get back home from school. Lucky and I are about to go with Ro Ro, have our little outing, run our errands that we need to run. Where are we going? Home Depot. No, nope, we're not. We're going to the park. The what? We back from Home Depot. Come on, Robo. Come on. Daddy wants you to help him. We got to spray these doors. Okay. I'll, but Dad, I don't know how to. Come on. Because what I don't like 
is this squeaking on my nose every day. Ooh, is that dust? It's dust. You should get a rag. Yellow bag. He just damaged my walls. Turns out that that stuff is oil. Like an oil. It's like an oil base. So hopefully this dries, but if it doesn't, we're gonna have to paint. Cause yeah, we can't we can't be looking like that. I just woke up from a nap. <laughs> so funny but it's not funny but it's funny i am still Garage tired going. put your seatbelt on but it's hot. so basically put your seatbelt on boy i cleaned i uh cooked it still didn't go down oh my god you gotta go move <laughs> some over there i ain't going up back <laughs> just leave it open no 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 bro just leave it open it's so hot out here yeah it's like 40 thousand degrees 106 we're gonna pick up my brother houston are you excited? Yes. Did you miss him? 